Hello folks, it's time to look under the hood of Samsung's future-based the Galaxy S24. ARM, the British firm that designs the basic architecture for processors found inside old smartphones, tablets and wearable devices, has unveiled its next-generation CPU and GPU cores. The company's new Cortex-A520, Cortex-A720 and Cortex-X4 CPU cores bring performance and power efficiency improvements, making future smartphones, including Samsung's, faster. We expect to see these new CPU CPU cores in MediaTek Dimens T9300, Samsung Exynos 2400 and Qualcomm Snapdragon Agent 3 processors later this year or early next year. The Galaxy S24 series is expected to feature the Exynos 2400 and the Snapdragon Agent 3 chips. All new CPU cores from ARM are 64B only, which means they won't support 32-bit applications. The processors can feature up to 14 core CPUs, which means they can also be a great fit for PCs and laptops. However, in the smartphone ecosystem, we could see brands like MediaTek, Qualcomm and Samsung using a OnePlus 5 Plus 2 design for their octa-core processors, one Cortex X4, five Cortex A720 and two Cortex A520. Compared to last year, ARM is claiming a CPU performance jump of 27% in multi-threaded tasks. ARM also claims that its Cortex X4 CPU core is 40% more power efficient than Cortex X3. The Cortex X3 is used in chips like the Dimensity 9200 and the Snapdragon Agent 3 chips. It means that chips using the Cortex X4 CPU core will be a lot more power efficient when performing high-end tasks like camera, gaming and multitask. The ARM Cortex X4 offers a considerable improvement in performance and battery efficiency and it will be used in high-end smartphones and tablets. It can go as high as 3.4 GHz and has a 2 MB L2 cache to X compared to last year. The Cortex A720 is optimized for efficiency even more than the A700 cores before it. It is 20% more efficient than the A715, which itself was 20% more efficient than the A710. With 5 A720 cores, they'll do a lot of the heavy lifting for multi-threaded workloads and will do it efficiently. Finally, the Cortex A520 is still an in-order core. It is 22% more efficient than the A510. On high-end chipsets, these will likely focus on background tasks. These performance and efficiency improvements will come to the Galaxy S24, Galaxy S24 Plus, Galaxy S24 Ultra and the Galaxy Tab S10 series. Hot on the heels on the ARM announcement, MediaTek confirmed that it will release its next generation flagship smartphone processor using confirmed that it will release its next generation flagship smartphone processor using ARM's latest CPU and GPU cores. MediaTek's next generation flagship processor, the Dimensity 9300, will use ARM's Cortex X4 and Cortex X720 CPU cores along with the Mortalis G720 GPU. While the company didn't reveal the complete core count and configuration, reliable Chinese tip state Digital Chat Station posted on Weibo that the Dimensity 9300 is an octa-core CPU with four Cortex X4 cores and four Cortex A720 cores. Can you believe it? Interestingly, it doesn't seem to use the power-efficient Cortex A520 CPU cores. These small cores are used in all chipsets to carry out smaller tasks, while intensive tasks are handled by performance cores like the Cortex X4 and Cortex A720. So, it would be interesting to see how MediaTek will handle heat and power efficiency as those high-end cores need more physical space, generate a lot more heat and consume much more power compared to power efficient cores. Usually, flagship Android chips use just one prime core like the Cortex X1 or Cortex X2, but the Tensor G2 used two Cortex X1 cores at lower clock speeds. Google said that this configuration works better with medium-intensive workloads. The tipster claims that Dimensity 9300 consumes 50% lower power compared to the Dimensity 9200. If that's the case, the upcoming chip could be much more powerful than the Exynos 2400 and the Snapdragon Agent 3 while being more power efficient. However, these figures seem far-fetched, especially when there are no Cortex A520 CPU cores. It is possible that those power efficiency figures are only for certain workloads. It is also possible that the chipset could be for Chrome OS or Windows laptops, but if those figures are real, Samsung fans might get jealous of the chips as the company doesn't use MediaTek Dimensity processors in its smartphones and tablets. Smartphones based on the Dimensity 9300 will be released in late 2023 or early 2024. Oppo, Vivo and Xiaomi could launch phones using the Dimensity 9300. Anyway, we will keep you updated, so subscribe to the channel. See you in the next video. Good luck to all!